George Clooney is very good friends with your husband, yes. Randy, uh, and I understand that uh, those two enjoy going out on the town together, sometimes having a few drinks. Is that fair to say? Uh, they have been known to go out and have a few tequilas, yes. Mm -hmm. And it's uh, got a little out of hand at some point, I understand? Yes, George is very well behaved now that he's married to the lovely Amal, so... Mm -hmm. um, Sounds but, like a press release. Okay, but go ahead. But <laughs> there, was, there was a time before he met Amal that he and Randy had gone out, and uh, they, they did ask me if I wanted to come, but it was a Sunday night, and I stayed home with the kids. And sometimes if Randy goes out late, he'll go into the guest room, because the, ki the kids will end up falling um, to sleep with me in my room. And so I, I got up, because I wanted to make sure he was home safe, and I went in the guest room, and I see Randy, like, face down on the bed. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, oh, my. And he still has his motorcycle boots on. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, really? Like, I, so I go over, I get on the bed, and I'm like, hey, babe. And he looks, and it wasn't Randy. It was George. <laughs> and I don't know who was more shocked, me or George, because, you know, I've woken George up out of a dead, slightly inebriated slumber. Mm -hmm. And... So he's like, oh, my God. And, and I was like, oh, my God. And then I ran out. What, what were you doing this? Were you... Well, I wasn't. <laughs> I wasn't. You were only wearing a snake. You know. <laughs> yeah. Well, it depends who tells the The snake story. was like, that's George Clooney. Why? <laughs> I was covered, but not as much as I would have normally been covered if I thought I was waking up George Clooney. So I run out. I find, and I find Randy, and I wake him up, because now I'm like, well, everyone else is awake. Randy right, should be right. awake. He was in my daughter's room. I'm like, what, why is George in our guest room, and why didn't you tell me? And um, then we hear George get up wandering around. He decides to go down to the kitchen. So then I hear Randy go down. They're laughing. So then I go down, mm -hmm. and we just all laughed. And we thought, how funny would it have been if the light wouldn't have been on? Right. Because I would have just gotten in bed. And then we were saying, how would George and I have explained that in the morning? Like, George and I wake up. We just, like, walk out of the guest room, and Randy's like, what is going on here? I just know there are many ways in which I'm not George Clooney. <laughs> many ways. But one is that if you mistakenly thought I was, that I was your husband and nudged me, I'd be like, yes, I am your husband. <laughs> yes, I am Randy. <laughs> it is time. For you to get into bed now!